you know, we talk about focus. And I've seen the maximum focus in three situations. When a batsman like Virat Kohli is facing the, the most challenging baller, or a baller like Jaspit or Mayang today is hurling at 150 plus. That is the focus. The second focus, what I have seen, which is second to none, is a pregnant mother entering labor pain. The only thing they want to do is to deliver a baby and a healthy baby. Nothing else matters. The third focus I have seen is at Churchgate Railway Station at 6.45, when a train co local comes and you want to get in the lightning speed and take a seat. An entrepreneur in growth, acceleration, a good entrepreneur, I'm not talking about, there are a bunch of not so good entrepreneurs. I mean, they will, they will fail at some stage and that's the Darwin's law. They have this kind of a focus. One of the focus is to build solutions which are second to none, number one. Number two is to get business as much as you can. And I teach, as you know, Kavi, I teach go to market. I put three vectors. Is your prospect have the money? Have they allocated the money to the project for which you have a solution? Number two, are they hugely profitable or growing in the corporate sense? In the government sense, is the budget allocated? Number three, are they early adopters of technology? Now many times, may most of them would fail on one or second or third. The idea is you want to close the deals fastest, quickest, and at a price that will help your enterprise grow. Now one of the things that most of you probably never faced is to write a check from your savings bank to pay for your employees. And when savings bank does not have the money or the investor that you're trying to get is gone on a uh, vacation. That can also happen when you are expecting government to write you a check and the bureaucracy kicks in. So these are the things which are an entrepreneur will face. So that is a challenge for us. Now coming back to the cricket, today's team plays to win. We have forgotten the language during 60s, we didn't have bat and ball and all that. We have just forgotten that language. Today when we are out there, we are playing to win. I think today's India has that mindset. But our mechanisms are still old-fashioned. Mechanisms are old-fashioned. So if you want to get hold of smart entrepreneurs and young minds over there who are thinking, we need to, we need to do that. For anyone to build a credible business on technology which will actually motivate decisions maker like this to buy from you, it has to be globally competitive and well brand. Otherwise, their practical sense will be this is too risky, I can't risk it. That requires 30 million to 200 million dollars of funding most of the time. In Mojo Networks, before we built anything, we raised a 10 million dollar round on the PowerPoint because we knew that in our lifetime, that's what we will have to build. So one crore is good, two crore is good, 15 crore order is actually extremely good, but that's what you will have to do. The entrepreneurs have to be ahead of the time in fundraise. And any of you talk to the successful entrepreneurs in India today, they are at least year and a year and a half ahead of time. So if I need funding into money in 2025, I want to start my fundraise now. Now, whether it is 1 crore or 400 crore. So for entrepreneurs also have to understand that is a, another thing. You will have to, as entrepreneurs, we will have to work with them to find how to sit into their system because they are ready to. My example, you know when we showed them what our radio can do in Vezi office, I can turn off internet on and off just by turning on my sensor. And uh, they, they accepted us. So. We have to find a narrative as entrepreneurs to be meaningful to them. Low cost does not win you business. Because whether we like it or not, 
low cost is unfortunately associated with low quality. So if you tell them this is going to cost you a million dollar, they may not like it, but they will consider you. If I tell them, you know, America is selling you for a million dollar, I'll give you for fifty thousand dollars. Inko samajh mein nahi aaya kuch. That's human. That's human. So we'll have to, as entrepreneurs, we'll have to make sure that when the government is coming so forward, we also have to play over this thing. And for all of us on the decision making, we have to build these companies. Uh, you know, my last point, Kavi, government is today like a grandfather, very willing to do, but some of the mechanisms are old. So we need to bring the, the Dadaji to the modern ways of doing it, and we have a lot of money with them. Thank you.